Here is a useless piece of information about every League of Legends champion. Also, we just hit 90k subs the other day and are so close to hitting that 100k milestone. So if you enjoyed and would like to support me on this journey by gently poking that sub button, it would seriously mean so, so much to me. And of course, here's your puppy. Thanks, guys. Steric's Gage is Aatrox's left arm. Arya is the overall most visually appealing champion in all of League of Legends. She is ranked 6th in NA, 10 in Brazil, and 1st among China and Korea. She is also ranked 1st among men, classic, and 2nd among females. Akali has a small crush on Kane, but she thinks he's crazy, hence the voice line. Kane, why are the hot ones always crazy? During the alpha test, Alistar was simply known as Minotaur. The pose for Amumu's original icon for the bandage toss icon was a reference to Spider-Man. Anivia's Q Flash Frost missile was once a Nexus crystal. Annie had a sister named Daisy, but she drowned and Tibbers lost his button eye at the same time that happened. If you think all of Aphelios' weapons are overwhelming now, he originally had 25 different weapons. Ash's hawkshot is derived from the power of Anivia. Aurelian Soul's lower body isn't a part of his hitbox, which is also why it's semi-transparent. Azir's soldiers dance with him when he dances. Bard's ultimate used to be a global alt that could silence enemies hit. Riot loves ducks, which is why Blitzcrank's feet looks like duck feet. Fran's auto attack particles were the exact same as Morgana's before her rework. They were just orange instead of purple. Rom's shield was made by none other than Orn himself. During development, Caitlyn was called Amiria. One of the inspirations for Camille was Lin Beifong from the Legends of Korra. Even though they look nothing alike, Cass is Katarina's younger sister. In the League of Legends trailer from 2009, Cho'Gath was given T-Rex sounds. Corky's dance references the meme called Do a Barrel Roll from the Star Fox 64. Darius is 6 feet 5 inches tall. This is actually really cool. Diana's ultimate moonfall will display an icon representing a phase of the moon above Diana based on the number of enemies she pulled in with her ultimate. Here's one moon, two moon, three moon, and yeah, you get the point. Mundo was originally supposed to use mana and his passive at one point was even called Nevershade which granted him mana regeneration. Draven is the only champion to have two different critical strike animations, one for each arm's attack. The bat Echo uses is a clock's hour hand that he stole from a Piltover clock tower. Elise was the first champion to have a monologue during her login screen. Mythical islands haunted by ghosts and specters. Eve's W Allure was originally called Lust Dust. Ezreal was the first champion to have a champion spotlight. Fiddlesticks' color palette was turned from green to red during his rework to make him seem more demonic. Night Raven Fjord was nicknamed Zoro before they finalized her name. Fizz is a prehistoric Yordle over 10,000 years old. Elio is somewhere between 82 feet and 115 feet tall. It's really inconsistent. Nevertheless, this dude is huge. The original closed beta Gangplank didn't have a beard. This is what he looked like instead. Here's a bit of a Mandela effect for you, Garen actually yells Demacia when he uses his W, not his E or R. Nar's ability Hop is the shortest ability name in the game with only three characters, and also I do have to say the most creative as well. Gregus's quote, Oh yeah, is a reference to the Kool-Aid Man. Hey, Kool-Aid! Oh yeah. Graves was the result of players requesting a manly ranged carry. If you use Gwen's joke animation and start walking, she'll walk in a doll form for a few seconds. Hecarim's passive Warpath is one of two abilities in the game that scales with movement speed. Heimerdinger has the longest champion name at 13 characters long. Lowey was inspired by the movie Atlantis The Lost Empire. The meme Better Nerf Aurelia started almost 10 years ago now when everybody was complaining about OP champions in the game. Everyone expected them to be nerfed the next patch, but instead Riot just nerfed Aurelia out of nowhere. And the meme. Ivern is the only champion to have their basic attack changed from melee to range. The old Janet has an interesting quote where she says, Yes, it's true. For only $2.95 a minute, I leave you breathless. Which is a reference to, well, you know, her obviously being a fitness coach. <clears throat> 295 is kind of cheap if you ask me. Jarvan's ultimate is made up of 24 minions in the coding to make sure no minions can squeeze through the wall. Poking fun at his original quote, imagine if I had a real weapon. Mech Kingdom's Jack has a quote where he says, Would you look at that? I finally have a real weapon. Your boy Jace was the 100th champion released in the game. The word Jin makes the letter 4 on your keyboard if you put them all together. This may be the only time to redeem myself because in one of my first videos I said this completely wrong, but Jinx's dance is a reference to Jake's dance from Adventure Time, not Cartoon Adventure. Bullet Angel Kaisa's red chroma is a reference to Samus from Metroid. Callista was leaked by a Redditor named Y Renekt and Y a few weeks before the champion reveal and he was eventually banned because of it. Karma's lore was inspired by the series and TV show Avatar The Last Airbender. 
In season five, there was a bug where Karthus could stay in his death-defied state forever, and he had a win rate of 87%. Kasten's breathing is a reference to Darth Vader from Star Wars. Also, his breathing only starts when his E is ready to cast. Kasten's auto attacks also kind of sound familiar to a lightsaber. The original animation for Slave Bell Katarina's recall had her pole dancing on a candy cane, but Riot removed it and now she just cuts it down. Once Kale hits level 11 or becomes a flame, Kale's icon will change from this to this. According to the lore, the blue streak in Kane's hair is because of his use of Roust. Karate Kenan is a reference to the Karate Kid. The name Kazix means you face yourself in an old mortal language, possibly Shuriman. Kindred was originally going to have different skins based on each of the different regions, but the idea was later scrapped. Before Rel was released, Dismounted Kled had the lowest base movement speed out of all the champions. Kagama was the very first champion to have a joke animation. In the lore, LeBlanc is capable of creating multiple clones of herself who assist her in doing her tasks. The name Lee Sin is a play on the word listen. Leona's design was heavily inspired by both Natalie Portman and writer Michael Marino's wife. Lilia's name and development was Cute Jungler. Before Lissandra became Iceborne, her eyes were mauled out by Volibear. Lucian was the first champion to ever get a chromo pack for his classic skin. The creatures that Lulu polymorphs people into are called Squills, which are basically squirrels with two tails. Lux's ultimate used to be called Infinite Light. Malphite's E icon shows a fist punching the ground, but the animation itself is actually him slamming the ground with an open palm. Malzahar is voiced by Vic Mignana. You may know him from his work in Full Metal Alchemist. The visual update for Maokai's W Twisted Advances was made to resemble Zyra's E grasping roots. Master Yi's fighting style, Wuju style, was named after two Riot employees, Andy Wu and Jeff Ju. Misfortune's twin pistols are named Shock and Awe, which are named after an old military tag. One scrapped version of Mordekaiser's ultimate was basically a ranged version of his death realm. You could cast the ability like Urgot's ultimate and anyone hit would be put in the realm. Morgana only received a visual update because her kit was consistently healthy throughout the years. When playing Nami, you used to be able to type in hat into the store search bar and boots would come up which is a reference to the Little Mermaid, but they took it out for some reason. Nasus literally means nose in Latin and is Susan backwards. Rawr. When Nautilus is swimming in the air and humming a tune, he's actually humming the same tune from the Spongebob movie when Squidward was in the shower. Nico waves at jungle camps when she walks by them. Nidalee used to have a bug where she could actually kill her own teammates. Her E Primal Surge accidentally applied damage, and since you could use it on allies, you could actually kill or hunt teammates with it. Doctor would like to let you know that only a small percentage of you who are watching this are subscribed, so if you enjoy, please consider smashing that sub button. Also, Nocturne's name was originally called Nightmare. <laughs> Nunu was named after rioter Steve Feeks' dog, and he also gave the nickname Nunu to his wife. When using the Broloff skin, he says, Romacia! Mocking Garen. Oriana was originally listed as just Ball Girl. Orn crafted the Howling Abyss, including the bridge above it. Pantheon's secret dream is to become a baker, hence the skid Baker Pantheon. Poppy's favorite food or candy is the Lollipop, hence the Lollipoppy skin. Pike can make his skewer stop glowing using Control 5, but it'll start glowing again at one minute or whenever he respawns. Kiana was originally supposed to be able to control fire as well, but it was later scrapped because there wasn't enough fire on Summoner's Rift. Quinn's crossbow is made up of the horns from the same creature that killed her brother. Rakan hits targets far away with his cape, but punches them if they're close enough. And when he was released, punching them actually did one extra damage. Okay. Rek'Sai is a female and is one of the few champions that don't speak a language. Rel was trained with the sole purpose to defeat Mordekaiser because she bends metal and Mordekaiser is pretty much all metal. Renekton clarifies himself as a crocodile in the Legends of Runeterra, not an alligator. Rengar originally had blue eyes in the lore, but he lost his left eye to Kha'Zix. Riven is easily one of the most difficult champions in the game to master, but only has two bars of difficulty on the info screen. All of Rumble skins have only been released in the month of April, so if you're waiting on a new Rumble skin, it may be a while. A lot of people joke about the world rune in Rise's splash art looking like an ice cream cone. Samira's accidentally released to the PBE server before they revealed her. Air Cavalry Sejuani was released in celebration of the Russian server's launch. Tenna does a somersault after her ultimate ends. Seraphine's favorite flavor of ice cream is cotton candy. Set has the highest win rate when an Aurelian soul is on the team with him. Chaco's eyes are blue in game and in some loadouts, but purple everywhere else. Shen was the first champion to use energy as a resource for abilities. Shivana's ultimate is the only non-toggle ability in the game without a cooldown. Singed holds his shield with his left hand in the splash art, but his right hand in game. This was one of the very first mock-up designs of Scion. Sivir originally had pink hair. Battlecast Alpha Skarner has a quote where he says, You have been chosen. 
which is a reference to Toy Story. In the lore, Sona is mute or unable to speak, so instead she uses sign language to communicate. Soraka's dance is a reference to a commercial for Shakita Bananas. I'm the top banana in the world today. When you play Swain, a bunch of ravens follow you around the rift. Silas originally had an ability very similar to Set's W where you would store up damage taken and then send it all back in one blow. Syndra was originally spelt with a C instead of an S, but they thought an S fit better. Tom Kench is voiced by Pat Duke, who also did some work in Halo Reach. Talia's favorite animals are goats, specifically the fluffy ones. Talon is not his actual name, it's just what people call him. Garen is Tarek's lifelong friend in the lore. Timo's dance as a reference to the Badgers video. This is Thresh as a human and sorcerer before he became the Thresh we know today. Tristana's quote, Blast him! was inspired by Star Wars. Uh -oh. <laughs> Lil Slugger Trundle has an 86 on the back which represents 1986, the year the 3D artist who worked on it, CGS Amu, was born. It's said that Trinomir was made directly from a picture of Mark Murrow wearing a kilt and nothing else. Twisted Fate is a play on the phrase Twist of Fate which pokes fun at his theme of probability. Samson White Twitch's recall is a reference to the player Imp rolling around in the grass at Worlds. Udyr was available to play for free on the day of his release because he was immediately added into the weekly champion rotation. Urgot's joke has a chance of retrieving a tea mushroom, a crab, a rubber duck, or on very rare occasions, a golden duck. Varys is ambidextrous and can shoot with both his left hand and right hand. Vayne's silver bolts is a reference to werewolf fiction and the idea that silver bullets could harm werewolves. Does this mean they should do extra damage to Warwick? Whenever Vygar kills someone with his ultimate, he'll do an evil laugh. <laughs> Velkaz's taunt is Schrodinger's equation written in visitor's language. Also, the text on his board thing won't line up when he moves around sometimes. I was originally going to be a champion called Ruby who moved around on roller skates. Viego can turn into a training dummy if he uses his ultimate on them. Victor's third arm was originally just an arm, but Riot eventually added lasers to it because they couldn't figure out any other purpose for it. In other words, when you don't know what to do with something, just add lasers to it. Vladimir's blood type is B negative, confirmed by this quote. Go ahead, B negative. You'll be just my type. Out of all the champions, Volibear has the lowest win rate against Yorick. Warwick shares the same voice actor with Trindamir, Brian Sommer. The Wukong bot used to be called Monkey King bot in custom games. Zaya wears her wings as a cloak in order to blend in with humans. Xerath is a reference to Arkin from Starcraft. Shinzao took an oath that he may be killed if anything were to happen to Jarvan's father, Jarvan III. There was a time where Yasuo had an 80% ban rate. Yone's ultimate, Fate Sealed, was originally going to be called Nothing Personal. Yorick was originally supposed to be the Ruined King, but he wasn't supposed to be aware of it. The idea was that he would have amnesia and just not remember. But as you know, the idea was later scrapped. If you're attached to someone as Yumi, the game will not give you an AFK warning. Zack's ultimate, Let's Bounce, is a reference to Tigger from Winnie the Pooh. Zed is the only champion not to die during his death animation. Animation. He just falls into a portal instead. Ziggs' full name is actually Zygmund. Zillion's passive Time in a Bottle is a reference to the song Time in a Bottle by Jim Crochet. Zoe has a bunch of different walking styles that will randomly switch throughout the game, but they can also be switched manually using Control 5. When Zyra was released, she had three passives, all of which were Easter eggs. The first was bonus gold for killing Karthus or Scion, poking fun at the game Plants vs. Zombies. Second was one extra movement speed when Maokai was on our team. And third was getting a boost in size when hit by Leona's Sunlight. Alright, that was a lot of info. This one was a long one. So thanks for sticking around and watching. Make sure to check out my other videos here and I'll see you next time. Bye.